Well, one of the things that, that I find interesting, particularly with schools that have a long history like yours, is that sometimes there's a very specific jargon or, or code words, things that that work that developed uniquely in your environment. Are there any particular like code words or, or, or things, ways that you, you know, unique things to your school that would be really great if other people knew about them or shared them? Huh. Can you give me an example? I'm not quite sure if I know what you mean. At the Whole Life Learning Center, they have this thing where they, they make the kind of a, for those who are listening, a peace sign kind of thing. But what that means is they have love and respect and they have a whole thing around using that as a as a way to bring their meetings together. The Village Free School, they had this thing where, oh, stop seriously, that's what it was, is that stop seriously by the consensus of the, of the, of the whole school was, mm. you know how so many kids are roughhousing and something and someone says stop, but they don't really mean it. Oh well, yeah. Stop seriously became their code word for, no, you have to stop. And if you don't stop, I can write you up or, you know, do more, you know, bring in more resources to help. But you like that. Well, let's see. I mean, one thing that's kind of become, if we, you know, the sign language, the clapping for sign language, which we call it sparkle. Yeah, deaf applause. Yeah. Yeah. So if you, yeah, sparkle fingers. If, <laughs> right, if you agree with somebody, you know, we sparkle. And so that's kind of fun where if we're in a meeting, you know, you might see all these hands go up and like everybody's sparkling what somebody says. And that's kind of a sweet thing. You know, we have stop means stop. I think we might need stop seriously, but they say stop <laughs> and they still sometimes don't listen when right. stop <laughs> comes up. So I think that yeah. that was an ongoing discussion. We used to have like quiet coyote as a code mm. word for everybody come together and be quiet. That one uh, has waxed and waned a little over the years as far as like how responsive kids are. You know, they start making up like funny things like, oh, quiet llama, you know, and then they're still talking and coming up right. with ideas. <laughs> like, what does that symbol mean? <laughs> so, and then they're still, right. like, they're not quiet. This is the Agentic Schools podcast, where you will learn about schools from around the world where children's agency to make decisions about their learning and living is more important than their academic skills. I'm your host, Don Berg.